In Chaco Canyon, New Mexico, the Pueblo Indians built an elaborate village in the midst of the desert. The Spanish referred to it as Pueblo Bonito, which means pretty village. But by the time the Spaniards saw it, it was already the abandoned set of ruins that survive to this day. But the desert doesn't hide everything. Seen from above, this Pueblo village reveals a number of circular structures. The Pueblo Indians referred to them as kivas, sacred places where ceremonial rituals took place. Why a circular structure? Circles have cultural meaning in that they refer to the cycles of nature. In particular, four naturally recurring celestial events were of importance to ancient cultures. The winter solstice, when the Earth's axis is tilted farthest away from the sun. The summer solstice, when the Earth's axis is tilted closest to the sun. The fall equinox, when the Earth's axis is not tilted in any direction away or toward the sun. Day and night are equal in length, but after this point, the days become shorter in length, while nighttime is longer. The spring equinox, like the fall equinox, day and night are equal in length, but after this point, the days become longer. This annual cycle is represented by the circular shape of the kiva, and the Pueblo, like many ancient cultures, were interested in identifying these important events. The location of the sun on the horizon is an indicator of each of these four seasonal changes. Pueblo Bonito was built in such a way to highlight when these seasonal changes occurred. The alignment of shadows created by the sun was the best indicator of a solstice or equinox. Circular structures are ideal for tracking these astronomical changes. For example, the arrangement of rocks at Stonehenge in England is meant to align with the solstices and equinoxes in such a way that the sun appears between the massive stones. Whenever you are on the Earth's surface, your position marks out a circular line of sight to the horizon. Your position is at the center of the circle. The position of the sun on the horizon forms a radius of the circle. The various positions on the horizon for the various solstices and equinoxes form different radii with the center of the circle. Finally, the segments connecting these various positions of the sun form cords that define intercepted arcs. Whether a kiva or an observatory, circular structures are ideal for studying the night sky. Taking advantage of the geometry of circles, these structures have degrees of freedom that other structures don't have. In this program, you will see how circles have been used to solve real-world problems, as well as certain design challenges. In particular, this program will cover the following key concepts. Constructions using a compass and straight edge. The properties of circles. Arcs, chords, secants, arc length. Central angles and inscribed angles.